Well, the V-Strom, it's a great looking bike. Please uh, tell me a little bit about the concept. Okay, the concept is adventure is its purpose. Our engineers made this model from scratch. It has a brand new engine, chassis, and everything. Superb features are adapted to the new 800DE for riding over unpaved surfaces in addition to the on-road rideability, which has been the V-Strom signature since its debut in 2002. It seems like you've potential customers already because this is a bike that everyone's going to want. But right. tell us something about the design. Okay, yes. The distinctive design inherits the image of the original DRZ, DRB, yet gives modern look. It expresses aggressive and powerful off-road image. Okay, you said the engine is brand new. Yes, the brand new compact parallel twin engine with, uh, is with DOHC 776cc delivers 62 kilowatt 78 newton at 6800 rpm with 270 degree crankshaft. And what are the highlights on the body and the chassis? Okay, on the body dimensions are all four more for gravel off-road riding, like 220 millimeter uh, ground clearance, 220 millimeter front suspension stroke, and 220 millimeter uh, rear wheel travel, a lot of 220 millimeter here, tongue twisting, 21 inch wire spoke frame in front, and with protection such as an undercover, knuckle guard, and radiator guard. And it has a 20 liter fuel tank capacity plus reinforced seat rail for luggage cases, all for long touring. Excellent. So what kind of new technology has been adopted? Okay. We have a color TFT dash in here, display, through which you can monitor and command Suzuki Intelligent Ride System, SIRS, including Suzuki Drive Mode Selector, Traction Control, and Bi-Directional Quick Shift Standard. Same as the v 1050 DE, gravel mode and cancellable ABS on the rear brake are featured for enhancing gravel off-road rideability. Wow, what progress in technology. It's amazing how things have moved on so quickly. But right. um, what about color choices? Okay, choices are yellow like this one here and gray and black. And to complement this, both sides of the engine, clutch and magneto covers get special treatment. We believe this model is suited for anyone who likes to extend their touring on trail within the mountains. The new v fits for a wide range of riders, like entry level as we have A2 version, riders stepping up from smaller class, and even experienced riders who like middle size over 1,000cc plus bikes because of the size and ideal performance. So now I completely understand why you've gone for the 776 model. I mean, it fits there perfectly. But okay, this doesn't end our presentation here, does it? 